Oh, oh pal, a tomar por c***o. Right? Oh, I think not, right? it means nothing. Se fue a la <laughs> tabla. So we've got today, tomorrow, a small rest day on Monday, but next week, I mean, I, I don't no point in looking ahead. We've got a crazy day here today. And you know what's hilarious? Something just fell from the roof of this building and hit my camera. <laughs> I'm gonna scoot oh my over. Gosh, I was like, Hi, why, everybody. Is, why is Danny going out of frame? I know you want me Lauren, to, I told to be you the to main host, the, but Danny, you don't, need to, you don't need to do there this you much. What is going there was soundproofing, on? soundproofing from the ceiling. So the new studio we have here is actually not complete yet. We've been doing all kinds of stuff. And what you just saw, you can't fake. Um, hey, buddy, are you gonna... Are, don't Hi, shake your Aaron. head at me like this is on me, buddy. All right, Anna, this is it. You got two of your students. Pokey and Rubius, the XQC of of uh, of Spain, they call him that. Is that is that a fair nickname? You I think? think XQC is the Canadian Rubius. I must say, Rubius was there before. He's the OG. I'm gonna defend him. Oh, but I he, love he himself, that. I he love himself that. memes about it. He himself memes about that. So it's all right. But yeah, I, my heart is absolutely torn, and uh, I work with both of them very closely. I I have five students in PogChamps, but these are the two students that I have been working the most closely with. So I especially am nervous for both of them on how well they do, and I just wish they could both win the match. But obviously, that's not possible. So I just want them to do their best as if they were my two kids and made the better player win. This is going to be hard. I mean, the... Uh... The queen is under attack, the knight is pinned. He, he kind of has to find the move queen e6 here. Oh. I think so, and I was worried that if he chooses the d6 square, which looks like a natural choice, but this runs into a discovered attack, knight takes c6. It was so difficult to react to knight e5. I think Pocky showed a brilliant preparation. Bishop b5, knight e5 kind of refutes my setup because I didn't expect such an aggressive setup um, uh, by white in the London. It's usually c3 and everything is very calm, but right. no, bishop b5 and knight e5 immediately pointing out that the knight on c six and the queen on d7 could get into trouble well and now we see Brilliant. we see pokey executing perfectly the point everybody is after knight <laughs> takes c6 the queen is under attack and and she's bishop, winning a piece, <laughs> he hung a piece. Pokey, Let's... you're doing it Let me ask what I think. it's the first time that that someone plays this against him no i have visto this este perfil eh joder chaval la francesa eh see the bishop la francesa d6 la virgen He's currently talking about the Virgin Mary, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> so, moment of truth right now, will she see Rook C7? Pocky absolutely loves puzzles. She she has been on the puzzle grind from the very beginning, so I wouldn't be surprised if she spots some of those tactical patterns. She did it. I have a here, I think. King to be because he wants to escape to a7, but he doesn't see. She found it! She found the best move! Discover check and Rubius thought he could take the rook, but it's the bishop on g3 is the killer piece. You saw him try to take the rook with the bishop. He physically grabbed it. It was like, what the heck is going on here? Oh my gosh. What a ah! <laughs> Look at Rubius, rook c1, threatening rook b1. Oh my gosh, he's setting up a last minute mating trap. Okay. Holy bejesus snaps. Bucky needs to find a way to get some space for her king and moving up one square. Uh, could be a way actually oh but no if she, she has mate in one she has mate in one she also has mate in one if she had taken on a6 but that was really hidden instead she just oh, she, she just creates some space for it. her king no this is this is of course brilliant too because now she can run away with the king so even though she didn't see the mate um oh it still God. is checkmate on a6 but it's quite a hidden checkmate it, she was thinking more of the safety of her king yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I think now she realizes I it. was thinking about the safety of her king. I didn't even see she had mate in one. Um, yeah. I wasn't looking. Okay, wow. I'll, I'll, I think she will get it now. Even Bishop like before was a brilliant yeah. way to free the king. Two queens versus two rooks. Should be, should be good enough.
Another EH that. rook is hanging, and also a6. That, that pawn on a6 has been the, the hidden threat for the last yeah. couple of moves. I wonder if she will spot it now, or will she give queen d4 check, which is also a strong move. Queen e7, classy! That's <laughs> Very such classy. a smart move. That's a grandmaster play when you're winning to just get rid of your opponent's pieces because you no longer care yeah. if it's an equal trade. Just get them off the board. So again, it's not mate and one, but if you're watching as a fan and a viewer who wants to get better, that is a very human grandmaster thing to do and uh, applauses for, for Pokey are deserved for that. Rubis no, no is trying to run with the pawn. Okay. Uh, and now I the only chance the last chance is, is stalemate. No, I don't want to draw, sir. <laughs> Did Rubius offer a draw? Um, oh, Rubius offered a draw in the chess.com yeah. chat. Hilarious. <laughs> I was wondering what happened there. <laughs> of course, Pocky refuses. I think that was a joke from Rubius' side. I can't I even hear what he's saying, saying, but I'm reading his lips and he's saying, Stall, 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 The Pokey's problem is she's playing against someone who <laughs> knows a trick. Pocky taught me that the queen should be a knight shadow away. So the shadow of the knight is right now on CH. Tables. She will never bring it too close. Pokey she knows Tables. that when the king is Tables. in the corner, a knight Tables. shadow is needed of distance. Tables, Pokey Mari. Tables. She knows it. Tables, Pokey Mari. Tables, Tables! <laughs> I don't want to uh, stalemate, you know? <laughs> Wow. Unbelievable What a roller coaster. And here we go with the French, and they're playing principled moves, even if they're not the theoretically best moves in the French, right? Because you could argue, okay, if, if a grandmaster sat down was playing white here, they might they might be able to do some damage, and, and they'd probably look to open the center um, and kind of uh, punish black there. But but also, it doesn't mean what Pokey's doing is wrong. We know c5 is the idea. Usually, it comes after an e5 advance to undermine this d-pawn. That's kind of the risk. Is it, Does Rubius realize that this isn't a normal French and that he might have an option to just kind of blow things open right now? I'd be curious to see what he does. I wonder if he's considering those moves. He plays bishop to a4, which may create tactical opportunities for Pokey, because now the knight on c3 has too many things to do, has to be guarding the bishop, and also has to be guarding the e4 pawn. Yeah, I and, think Pokey is spotting it, captures immediately. Yeah, she doesn't have to be asked why she takes it. Now, will she see she can even take with the knight here now, because she unpinned the, uh, the knight to the queen. This would be... Okay, both are good. In fact, actually, pawn takes is probably even better. I just thought knight takes might have really, really shown that she understood uh, the power of bishop e7. But maybe this is even better. Now she can win the d-pawn and just... Wow, pokey. Pokey main. Pokey the beast. Yeah, I think she will castle. She she does know her opening principles very well. Um, if she doesn't castle, it will be because she spots a tactical pattern. But yeah, makes perfect sense to castle. And now for Rubius, some of the ideas could be to, to chase that knight away from d4 because it's a very strong piece for Pocky, or try to bring the knight back from a4 because it's a bit of a sad piece on the edge of the board. Pocky needs to be a bit careful here because queen b3 does set up a threat. The knight on c6 can be undermined by the capture on c6 and then the bishop on b4 is hanging. So I wonder if she will move the bishop away or will she spot that she could place that knight on d4 because there's a knight fork on e2 but that's a bit that's a bit too much way too dank oh a6, a6 oh a6 didn't didn't guard the bishop but now rook d1 instantly by rubius so pocky has a chance to defend the bishop with the queen queen e7 or queen a5 o sea, tough position for him uh but po pocky este caballo me lo puedo llevar de free on trading ah, and simplifying no. now and it doesn't mean she may not pues see Queen C5 next. She might siguiente. see it right now, but but I think overall she's had a, a mission and she's been sticking to it. I'm up a bunch of pawns and I'm gonna trade pieces. I oh. think she sees it. I think she was just making sure whether it's a bishop or queen check that's better because now the knight is hanging and the e5 bishop too is in the air. Yeah, she is, she is on fire and improving by the by the day. Anybody watching this should be be afraid of Pokey Main. Be very afraid. She is she is getting better at chess. It's absolutely smooth sailing. She takes the bishop on e5, and now she's threatening bishop to c5, and I'm sure she sees it. I'm sure she sees it because her grind... Oh, knight to 
D7, hence the it. knight. He brushes her shoulder off. No, no big deal. Like, instantly took yeah. that knight. Like, instantly. No problem. Wow. Yeah. Rubius was... <laughs> Rubius was drawing us an arrow to the C5 square, I thought, on, on his stream, so... <laughs> what, what does that mean she's saying with the... I don't speak fluid coolness. I'm not I think cool. that was a W. I, oh, okay. I wasn't that's, thinking that's in the right w, moment, I but I... I'm always afraid I'm going to make an inadvertent, inappropriate sign that means something. And so I don't, I don't like to make signs with my hands. It doesn't go well. Uh, maybe Rubius offered a draw again. <laughs> oh, Rubius it's, offered a draw. Becoming... LOL. I see the chess.com game chat going nuts with it. LMAO. No está nada, eh, no está nada mal para el, para el primer torneo. O sea, no está nada mal. 50 segundos, os va a decir, a ver, ole, 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 ole. Eh, ¿Cuál es el plan? Ok, we have checkmate in one if, if she sees it. I think she will spot it. Again, she has been on the puzzle grind ever since she started practicing chess. So, Yo it's entiendo, very likely that she sees it or she plays bishop c5 focus. and then goes for a similar o sea, idea. Y Pokémon no está jugando más a nivel, o sea, yo aquí no sé qué está pasando. O sea, 681, my balls. Debería estar contra Magnus Carlsen esta señora. O sea. Hola. Es flipante, siempre encuentro la manera de cagarla, chat. Siempre encuentro la manera de cagarla, pero bueno. Aquí creo que me llevo una pieza gratis, eh. Aquí me llevo una pieza gratis, o el alfil o esto. No está del. Todo del todo del todo acabado, ¿vale? Del I don't todo, think no he sees todo, the no mate because he's saying that he's gonna get one of the pieces for free, that he can take either the d7 knight or the b4 bishop, so he doesn't see that it's checkmate here for Pocky. And I don't think she sees it just yet either because she would have played it already by now. Shout out to Mark 100 net with the $100 donation just now. We love you, Mark. You're helping us reach that goal. I think we're gonna get there before the day's over. Okay. Thank you so much, everyone, for the contribution. She defends the bishop on b4, allowing queen takes d7, but then bishop c5, queen f1 will be checkmating too. I think this is what she has set up. Yeah, I'm, sh I'm sure she sees yep. it. She Here plays we bishop go. c5. Here we go. Only move. Boom. So rather than going for the mate in one, she goes for the five head play of mate in two, even harder. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> no draw! <laughs> he keeps no. offering her a draw and giving her a thumbs up. <laughs> draw so is a good funny. play here, says chess.com chat. I think they might be a little biased. There might be a Rubius fan lurking there. <clears throat> nada! 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 I think that means nothing. I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> But I did stay oh, in the last night. Oh, pal! Ah, toma por c***. Got it, right? Oh, some trick! I think nada right? means nothing. Se fue a la c***. Tablas! Oh my god, I did not think I would win a single oh, match in this tournament, so... Pokey, we, we, we went to this moment here in this first game where you played B4, and we were talking about how while this is a dangerous pawn, it could be one that backfires if you recognize the C file. How early did you realize that even though you lost this pawn, that the game was not over and that you had a chance to make a comeback here with this tactic? To be completely honest, um, pawn pushes are a weakness of mine for sure. So I was kind of, you know, I was feeling myself. I was like, let's do it. And immediately after I was like, oh no, he has check. Oh no, I block with my queen. Oh no, he has my rook. <laughs> and I was this close to resigning. So close, so but close. But you didn't, you <laughs> <Yeah>. didn't. <laughs> but you could have taught me, don't resign. Uh, you know, uh, forget what the teacher said in, <laughs> in a queen's gambit, just keep playing. But so I kept playing and I got really lucky with the, uh, with the discover check and finding a tactic there. So yeah, it was kind of just, I, I felt bad. I felt bad if I resigned there. But if you ask me for a draw, that moment i would have accepted immediately immediately okay. why didn't you accept my draws they were there <laughs> yeah you offered yeah. them just a little too late i'm like mating two and you're like draw <laughs> draw yeah it, it was fair it was fair and rubius yeah. what what were you thinking here because and, and it, it is a good lesson for future games right you won the rook mm -hmm. you took pokey's rook um but you decided to keep the queens on the board and is it because you just you get nervous with the queens being traded or were you were you not realizing yeah. how big your advantage was if you had traded queens? Mm. 
No, I think it is the, the second thing, yeah. I always feel like, uh, and that's something I have to learn, that uh, I sometimes have to to uh, trade queens. Right. Because uh, if not, uh, yeah, the game goes very bad for me, like like this one. But one thing I want to say is that the, the most amazing thing about these two matches with Pokey were the openings, her pawn openings. Uh, it was like suddenly... Uh, I had like uh, zero pawns and she had taken an, almost all of my pawns in the second game. I don't know how she did it. Like nice. I, it took me like three minutes to realize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. take so the really blame. I, I'm, I'm taking full full responsibility because I think I prepared very, very complex openings for you. And Pocky knows her lines very well. So she she has been practicing yeah. the London and the French defense. And even if even if I show you a line, she will still have more experience in it. So for next time, I will know I need to go for something simpler where we, we keep our pawns safe. But it, I was in such a <laughs> difficult spot. And Danny knows I, I spent the whole match being nervous for both of you. I wanted both of you to do your best and i wish you could both win um but ruby is something Wait, can i mention something <laughs> anna is so sweet and cute for my match yeah. against xqc she sent me two videos that are like 10 plus minutes long oh me too hey, these are yeah, some yeah. things to remember blah, blah, wait blah. she sent you then, videos too yeah yeah and then against rubius oh, she was like for you. Three minutes. <laughs> hey listen i love you guys both and i care about you both and i hope you both win and i'm sorry but like i'm just coaching you both and i don't know what to do and i hope you can get yeah, yeah, me too. yeah she said this i was like you're so nice yeah she's amazing anna is amazing the best teacher we could have absolutely we, <laughs> We, we've known that yeah, in the chess community. Anna, Anna is the biggest sweetheart in the chess community. We've known that secret for a while, but now the rest of the streaming community is figuring it out. She really is. And I, her coaching is evident. Pokey, you said in that moment when you won, you were just being honest. You were like, I didn't think I was going to win a match this whole tournament. Yeah. Now not only have you won one, you might That's be cool. one of the favorites to move on to the championship bracket. I mean, how, how are you feeling about your <laughs> chess right now? Um, I kind of just... Uh, put myself into this mindset of I'm here for a good time and so as long as the matches are fun I hope it's a fun viewing experience for everyone and if that's the case then I'm happy so in that sense you know less nerves and just hoping for the best yeah and Rubius, I was going to tell you that um, I, d I didn't want to tell you how the group stage is going, but mm. um, you want a rematch against XQC, and this is your chance. Pocky is your ticket to a potential <laughs> rematch, because if Pocky beats XQC today, at the end of the day, they're yeah. going to play today, then Pocky is going to the championship bracket, and you go to the same bracket as XQC. So I know you're okay. not happy about Why the result. Play? Of course, <laughs> the tournament is just oh, beginning. Okay, okay, okay. The tournament. Okay, do you remember? I, I, I thought I was done. No, no, no. Do you no, remember no, no. the video I sent you about XQC drawing the bracket? You are going to that yeah, bracket. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. And yeah, but Pocky I thought wins, that was if I won today. Okay. No, no, okay. no, 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 no. It, it didn't matter for you. It didn't matter what you do, but because Pocky won, she can also win against XQC, and then XQC and you go to the same okay. part of the bracket, and that's what you want because you want to prove that you are the OG. <laughs> you are the real Rubius. He is copying yeah. you, right? That's what we need to prove by the chess moves yes, you make on right. the board. <laughs> exactly. That's the plan. Yes. Yes, yes. You can play against him in the finals. It's still possible. Cool, cool. Okay, Pokey, you have to kick his ass today, okay? <laughs> I'll do my best. I'll do my best. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, thank you both again for an awesome match and great interviews. Pokey, good luck. We'll see you, I guess, in, in a couple thank hours. You. And, and Rubius, ha yes, have a great soon. day. And, and best of luck in thank maybe you. your future rematch versus XQC. Yeah. Bye. Thank Bye. you both. Bye.